Time now for that most accurate forecast. I'm meteorologist Iris Hermosillo. Things are changing this week as we get a boost in moisture. That's going to really kick things into gear when it comes to our monsoon and our monsoon storm chances. So essentially, we've got daily chances for storms this week, and temperatures as a result are going to trend down too after a sizzling hot weekend. Part of the reason we got moisture heading our way is Hurricane Enrique. Enrique rather, It's off the coast of Mexico, off the coast of Baja, California. It is a Category 1 storm that's going to continue to move to the north, potentially impacting that Baja California Peninsula by midweek as a tropical storm. Now it's going to stay south of Arizona, but it's essentially going to boost that moisture and that moisture will be moving into our state. And with that extra moisture, we've got a better chance for monsoon storms. Plus we've got high pressure sitting to our north. So that flow around that area of high pressure will give us a better potential of getting storms off the higher terrain, primarily the higher terrain north of the valley today and tomorrow. But even to our east, more storms over those mountains and the potential is there for those storms to move off the mountains and into the valley essentially every day. But the moisture really starts to surge in Tuesday through the rest of the week. So we've got a chance for storms today, but those chances get better Tuesday, Wednesday, and then Thursday. And essentially notice we've got daily storm chances in areas surrounding the valley with that potential for storms to move in every day as well. A 20% chance for showers and storms in the valley this evening. Then that chance peaks at 50% Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday, and we'll keep a 20 to 30% chance for showers and storms Friday and into the weekend. Those storm chances a little bit better even in the high country, especially Tuesday and Wednesday, Flagstaff with a 70% chance for showers and storms. Now that means with daily storm chances, we've got to be on the lookout for all of these hazards, high winds, the potential for blowing dust, even some small hail. There's also a risk for some flooding, at least in some of those burn scar areas over the higher terrain. For the valley, a moderate risk for flooding, not expecting that to be as much of an issue, but either way, some pockets of heavy rain will be possible with some thunderstorms. For today, look for some thunderstorms that could move off those mountains by late this evening, likely after 7 p.m. And then tomorrow, that potential gets a little bit better across the state, including right here in the valley. Temperatures will still be pretty hot today. We're talking a high of 109, but look at how temperatures will drop as that moisture increases. By Wednesday and Thursday, highs are down near 102.